with only four days left until 2k24 it's like you can feel the excitement building up because of all the 2k news we've been getting for the past couple weeks but in my last video we went over to see if 66 bills was going to be the metal bills and so far to me it looks like the 66 bills have got the better all around attributes but today we're going to be looking at joe knows video to determine which guard bill will be the best bill for patch one so let's get into it all right so like i said we're going to be looking at joe knows and this video right here i think joe knows shows like at least three or four different guard bills so of course we're going to be going over and see which bill will be the like the best one so as you can see hold on let's go ahead and get into this video right here straight top tier shooting and it looks like elite playmaking but i'm gonna be honest it's not top of the line playmaking not in all right i ain't gonna lie so to me looking at this first build it kind of all right you can see a 6'3 176 for wings man got a good acceleration got good speed speed with ball 84 i think speed with ball would matter I think this year's speed with ball is going to be how you speed boost, you know, determine if you speed boost, because y'all remember 2K23, acceleration was really, you know, speed with ball didn't matter. It was more acceleration than speed with ball in 23. But in 24, I think speed with ball will matter more than acceleration. But, you know what I'm saying? I could be getting that backwards. Y'all let me know. But anyway, he got a 99.3. So to me, this kind of looked like a, a build that you would take to the stage or a build that you would use if you got a lockdown. Do not make this build right here if you don't play with a lockdown. Trust me, you're going to get mad because you ain't got no defense. All they're going to do is baby you in the park, wreck, stage, wherever you mode you play. You know what I'm saying? So, but anyway, getting into the build, you know, decent driving layup, you know, uh, in case you do want to slash. 99.3, so of course you're going to get Hall of Fame limitless range. 92 ball handle, 87 pass accuracy. I think an 87 pass accuracy gives you bronze bailout. I might be correct. I think so. I think that's the bailout badge right there in the corner where my uh, mouse is. I think that's the bailout badge on Brian. So that's solid. 92 ball handle. Now, as you can see on the screen by Joe Noah's head, you know what I'm saying? 92 ball handle gives you gold speed boost. It doesn't get you Hall of Fame, but you still got gold, which is be, you know, you straight. 84 speed with ball. I'm not going to lie. I feel like the build okay. I don't think... I'll probably drop my three-pointer down, to be honest with y'all. I'll probably drop my three-pointer down to 96, because 96, I think that's gold. 92 is silver. And I think 80-something is bronze. But, yeah, I'll probably drop it down to gold, which is 96-3, and probably put my perimeter defense up a little bit. Like, I don't want to be slidey out there. But, again, this is a build that you'll use, you know, to play with a lock. You know what I'm saying? So, hey, I don't know. It's solid to me. Bad, looking at the badges, it look kind of solid. I see you get Hall of Fame Green Machine. You get Hall of Fame open looks. Uh, yeah, you're going to get all the Hall of Fame. What's that, Agent 3s in the corner right there? Yeah, you get Hall of Fame Agent 3s. With a 72 driving layup, you get, as you can see, Silver Giant Slayer. Uh, you get Dead Out Hall of Fame. Like I said, you get mostly gold and pluckable. I see that right there. So you get gold, playmaking badges, Hall of Fame shooting badges. This is basically like a play shot build. But yeah, let's go ahead and get into the next build. All right, so I skipped ahead just so I can see what the build you know what i'm saying will look like at this end so as you can see on this build you got more speed two more attributes more than acceleration you ain't got no strength that's crazy i feel like you're gonna need that physical handles badge like i said this build number two you know this six three six six this nine six three ball build so you see all the shooting badges that you get with nine six three ball still got the same amount of finish the same amount of defense really but you got more playmaking than the first build that y'all seen so you get an 89 pass accuracy again i think that gets you bronze bell out Passing gonna be, I feel like passing going, you're gonna need that this year too. So a 95 ball handle. So I think on the other build, he had like a 92 ball handle, which gives you good dribble moves, but doesn't give you the elite dribble moves. Cause I think Mike Wayne has said, Steve Francis is a 95, you know what I'm saying? Ball handle, you need a 95 ball handle to get Steve Francis. So he gets the elite dribble moves. He got a 92 speed with ball. Uh, Again, it's another build that you're gonna use with a lockdown, bro. I wouldn't use this build unless you have a lock to run with it, to be honest with y'all. But let's go ahead and get into the third bill. All right, so for the third bill, of course, this is grinding. You know what I'm saying? Shout out grinding, by the way, man. I hope he hit one million subs at 2K24. This is his guard bill, his John Moran bill. So we're going to take a look at it. So as you can see, point guard still, 6'2 six, uh, six height, 165 pounds, 6'8 wingspan. And as you can see, I'm already looking. 93 driving dunk, 92 three. So you still get silver limitless range. 93 ball handle. You don't quite get the elite dribble moves. You know, the Steve Francis at 95, but it's a 93 ball handle, bro. It's, there's no way you don't get no good you know what i'm saying dribble animations but anyway 93 speed with ball 83 93 ball handle 83 speed with ball you still don't get no defense 
but again it's another build that you'll run now with this build you still can shoot good as the 96 three ball 99 three ball but you can get to the rack more because again 93 drive and dunk the other two builds i showed y'all it had like 70 driving live and probably like a 50 close shot so you can actually get to the rack with this build uh acceleration good 95 a2 speed see the strength see the vertical see the 99 stamina now as you can see with the, for the badges you already get with this build you get gold posterizer slithery gold precision dunker bunny with a build like this bunny and whistle is going to be very important so it improves a player's ability to make hops their lives or dunks Increases the chances of drawing fouls trying to score for whistle and then you get aerial wizard you get two step improves the player ability to make your step cradle layouts or dunk so i'm not gonna lie if i had to pick right now i'll probably pick this third bill to be honest because i feel like like i said bro it's another bill you're gonna want to run with a lot because this is a very offensive heavy bill to be honest 75 pass actually i don't know about that because you don't get bell out so you know unless you're going in there if you're going in there with a bad like <laughs> layup animation where you better try to you better try to dunk every time if they rotate y'all know how people rotate to the basket you're not gonna be able to bail out because you only got 75 pass actually but like i said if you play with a lock it probably wouldn't be a problem you know what i'm saying you got iq you'll be straight but yeah so far i feel like i'm kind of rocking towards build number three to more i ain't gonna lie to y'all right, so this build right here is grinding i think he just said it because i you know i was listening to it a little bit he just said this is his steph curry build that he had dropped you know what I'm saying? So as you can see, 96 three-pointer, get gold, limitless range, 75 driving lib again. You know what I'm saying? If you want to drive to the rack, it's going to look very stiff. None of these builds got defense, you know what I'm saying? So if you play with a lock, you'll be fine. If you don't play with a lock, do not play it. Do not, you know what I'm saying, make this build. That's why I advise you. Unless you're playing with a lockdown, this is a build you will make. But, you know, good speed, good acceleration, good stamina good vertical as you can see for the badges 95 ball handle so he's gonna get elite dribble animations 91 speed with ball 91 pass actually that's tough i ain't gonna lie i kind of like that but anyway you see the you see the playmaking badges blow by on gold handles for days killer combos speed booster hall of fame which is tough a pluckable gold angle breaker he don't get physical handles though again we all gonna see how much strength matters because that physical handles look it lessens the chance of being bothered by defenders on the perimeter while dribbling so you know what i'm saying so and then plus he ain't got no strength on this build so we're gonna see how how small guards with no strength are gonna go up against locks with strength so we're gonna see how that in four days bro we're gonna see how it is in four days but uh y'all let me know what build y'all like man you know build number one two three or four and i'll put the timestamps down below but hey it's your boy dj i'm gonna catch y'all next video man and i'm out